Hi and welcome back to Cut the Craggle. So yesterday was the last day of the live streams for LEGO games at E3 2017. And whilst we sadly didn't get any confirmation about the uncertain year 3 for LEGO Dimensions, we did however get our first in-depth look at the upcoming Beetlejuice Fun Pack. Let's take a look. The gameplay opened up with Beetlejuice on Saturn, the limbo world inhabited by the sandworms in the film. Heading over to the house, we got our first look at some of the animations for Beetlejuice's character and his unique fighting style. He is able to turn his hands into mallets to smash and bash his enemies. Next up, we got our first look inside the Deets residence. Very quickly, it became clear that TTF put a lot of care and effort into making this a faithful, Beetlejuice gaming experience. The house looks just like it does in the film, and as they ventured upstairs into the attic, we saw that they even included Adam's town model and the entrance to the waiting room, where you can recreate the scene from the movie with Beetlejuice and the shrunken headman on the couch. Back in the attic, we got a closer look at the town model, and surprisingly, you can actually enter the town model and explore it. And, if you look up at the sky, you can even see that the sky dome is still the attic. Flying around a starfire, it looks like this has to be one of the biggest adventure worlds yet for LEGO Dimensions. There seems to be tons of key locations from the film, and lots of different quests and easter eggs to discover. We only got a brief look at Beetlejuice's vehicle, the Sandworm. But we did learn that he has a screaming sonic blast ability. I'm really excited for this fun pack. I can't wait to play as Beetlejuice and explore his adventure world. It looks like TT have done an incredible job of bringing this franchise to LEGO Dimensions. If this really is the last wave for the game, they're definitely going out on top. What do you think of the Beetlejuice gameplay? Let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you next time. Laters.